hey guys and welcome back to another video welcome to sabrina budgets and today's video is going to be paycheck number two for the month of june yes i did skip paycheck number one but i would go over paycheck number one and tell you guys what i did with that paycheck but in the meantime if you follow me on my other channel you would know why i didn't do paycheck number one i was going through some stuff so and this video is going to be a little different because obviously i am sitting in front of the camera and I just figured I would do something different um, instead of always showing my hands let me know if you like this part face-to-face -face type of videos so I did do so for the month of June the quote is you are right where you need to be and my June 2024 goals is to make an extra $200 take it take myself out um, on a self-care date or whatever date I wanted to take myself out for and then to try something new I have not tried something new but I believe I will be trying something new as far as promoting myself don't know if that's gonna be how I'm gonna do it but we'll figure it out I will let you guys know then it says important projects here is to declutter I've been decluttering since I don't know how many months now and to post five items up on Poshmark, Macari or eBay so paycheck number one as you guys can see I don't know if you guys can see it but paycheck number one went like this I got paid eight hundred fifty dollars three forty went to rent cell phone got ninety five Apple storage ninety nine cents Apple music seventeen ninety nine Kindle thirteen oh five Chase Flex got $40, Apple credit card $80, and Amazon credit card $35, which I did a boo-boo on my second paycheck, but I'll let you guys know where I made that boo-boo at. So the actual fixed expenses came up to $622.03, which leaves me with $227.97, and I left that overall in my bank account to see more or less how much I'm going to spend, and I spent every last penny of it I didn't I didn't leave anything I probably even had to add some more cash to that um amount amount because I made extra money on the side so I probably used that then so that was my overall my overview for paycheck number one now let's go into paycheck number two which was for the 21st rent got $342 cell phone got $100 I can't wait so I finished paying off my cell phone because I am going to change my cell phone company. Lifetime $4.99. Canva is $12.95. Chase is going to get another $40. I know I have not been doing the debt snowball and the reason for that is we are in summer so I'm trying to spend as much time with my kids. Not trying to spend too much money but you know just trying to have funds to be able to do things outside um, even though we're going through a heat wave right now as I'm looking out my window um, I'm not going out I went outside but I'm not going back outside today Amazon Prime is seven dollars and sixty one cents that total for fixed expenses is five hundred and seven dollars and fifty five cents so I am left with three hundred and forty two dollars and forty five cents groceries is going to get a hundred and seventy five dollars household is going to get 30 and pet is going to get 20 those variable expenses came up to 225 dollars which leaves me with 117 dollars and 45 cents those 45 cents are going into my emergency fund and just so you guys know <laughs> this is where i said a little while ago let me tell you guys what happens the leftover i'm gonna have to take out because I didn't take it out. Apple credit card. I have a payment. Let me see something. Um, 80. Um, Alright, so I'm going to have to. Out of those. Out of that 117. I'm going to have to take out for Apple credit card. $80. So my leftover or my buffer is going to be 
I can't believe I forgot that. And I can't believe I'm doing this in real time. I'm so sorry, guys. But this is life. And I make mistakes. And another mistake that I did, just so you guys know, is... I didn't take out for my metro card don't ask me how i forgot that but i forgot <laughs> i can't believe that i really really can't believe that i forgot to take out for my metro card but thankfully i have that money from taxes that i had extra for my car fare so i'm gonna use that because i have no other choice um and hopefully in the future I'll be ahead again on MTA. So that's going to leave me with $37 in buffer. So this is wrong. $37 in buffer. So the cash this time I did not take it out. I think I'm going to leave it in the bank again. Um, because I have to make a different um, cash envelopes for my wallet. Because the other ones that some of you guys saw they were ripping apart and the grocery one actually ripped apart so i definitely have to do that now that is it for my budget now let me tell you guys where i'm at in my um debt and i've been trying to hustle 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 but walking dogs that have not been it so my freedom flex at the moment is three thousand three hundred ninety eight dollars and seventy eight cents yes it went up guys i had to rent a car i had to go move my daughter out her storage at school and move her into her apartment and you guys like i said some of you do follow me over there so at my other channel and you guys will be seeing that but yeah i had to rent the car and you know you got to pay gas and all that stuff i'm going to make another payment can I make two payments? Hmm. I don't know if I can take I can make two payments in a day. Let's see. So I'm gonna do 40. Because I made a payment. So what I did was I took three hundred dollars out from my emergency fund and I paid off the rental with that because I need for this credit card to go down. I really, really do. Um so now I'm gonna make another payment for forty dollars. So okay let me see if i can hide this and as you can see guys whoa, can you see it i made a payment i'm trying to get that card down i really am um it's just things to be popping up i have to save for my washing machine my washing machine broke so i have to save for that before it starts to get really really cold outside or it starts snowing which will probably be late october you know early november that i'll probably purchase um a wash machine or i might just wait for black friday so i hope you like this new setup that i did um the only thing is i have to move my table back and forth from my room to here because i just realized the lighting in my room suck so i will have to try to figure out how the lighting to work with that lighting um because the ring light doesn't even look that well see right now i look a little decent i go to the room and i look like a raccoon and i have no makeup on and i do look shiny because it's really hot <laughs> i turned off the ac so you guys won't have to hear it so if you guys made it this far pick down below something summary whether it's a i don't know whether it's water whether it's a beach umbrella Hit that down below because then i know you made it this far and i appreciate you guys for tuning in and watching this video and i know i wasn't fully um how can i say that fully ready for this video but i i try my best to do every time but you know sometimes you just can't but i want to show this side of me instead of having to set stuff up and you know and i i because i make mistakes i have boobles right um, and I want to show you guys that like I'm not perfect like I make mistakes Look at my MTA. I didn't put no money aside for that and I forgot How did I forget? Don't have no clue, but I thankfully I have that ahead money for my transportation I am burnt guys. I went to the beach 
and my whole shoulders and my back is burnt so with that being said guys thank you so much for tuning in don't forget to hit that bell notification so you won't miss another video don't forget to subscribe and hit that like button and i'll be seeing you guys in my next video